Take one way to this one, Andy Wang. Wonderful, thank you so much. How are you? Welcome to the live. This is Oliver from Henan Glory Company. And if you're interested about like the, uh, if you're interested about the refinery equipment here, just leave a message here to let us know. And right now, the third one, you can totally see the differences between the third, the fourth one with the first two equipment here. And also check about it. Welcome, uh, Ocatville. Ocatville, welcome to the live. The first two, it is uh, degumming, deactivation. The third one, it is decolorization. And you can check the tank, it is totally different. The tank, it is totally different. You can check the top, especially for the top. Uh, it is uh, not a very, not like that too. Maybe we can come a little closer. Yeah, I can hold it. You guys can see, it is not very diff uh, same. This is the first two, decolor, uh, degumming and deacidification. And uh, these two, it is totally different with, the, uh, for, with, with that two. So for this one, it is decolorization and the deodorization. So for this third one, it is decolorization. Before we do the colorization, decolorization, we have to use our vacuum drying system to make sure this tank it is in the vacuum uh, situation and then we can input about the oil that that we want to deal with yeah and first we need to heat the heat transfer oil into the degree of 105 degrees and then stir for 30 minutes to do the dewatering and in a really quick uh, speed and then we have to add about the clay inside of the, the third tank. Welcome though, new, yeah, hi sir. Welcome though, sir. And I have already sent you about our catalog. If you're interested about this equipment, just leave a message here. We would like to show you more details. And then we add uh, the clay into this tank to do the decolorization. Yeah, and there are uh, previous customers ask, uh, uh, ask us how many clay we have to add in this uh, tank. And for this question, the answer is 1 to 3% to the oil use. And after 30 to 60 minutes, you can uh, done with the decolorization. And then you have to lower down about the temperature. That is not enough. And basically, we will have a leaf filter here. But right now, you, you guys cannot see about the leaf filter. But when we do it, we will have a leaf filter here, and we are not we are not using we are not using about like the play filter. We are using about the leaf filter. Why we do that? It is because uh, if we use uh, the the leaf filter, it is automatically to to clean about the filter. We do not need workers to do it, so it is really convenient for the workers to handle about all this equipment. And yeah, let's talk back to this decolor decolorization part. So when, you, uh, when we co cool down the temperature for this uh, decolorization tank, we will put all the oil use into the leaf filter here. So the leaf filters can filter about all the clay here. And after the, uh, after the clay, after after the filter, all the oils will back to this uh, decolorization tank and so that we can go into the next station. How much is this equipment, Mika Zhang? That is a really good question because there are so many uh, customers curious about